Yo B, they ready. Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. It's One Magic and I'm here today with a Dollar Tree haul. I know I look a little bit weird, but I need to change my contacts. Oh gosh, I need to change my contacts and they are they not cooperating. They don't want to come out. So I'm like struggling. <laughs> So I had to throw my glasses on top of them. They are they're done. You cannot I cannot see with those things. Anyway, so I have on these things and my natural hair is ratchet underneath. So yeah, this is how we're going to do this today. So I'm gonna do um, a Dollar Tree haul. It's uh, from two different trips that I made to the Dollar Tree, and I broke them up into categories. And I want to attempt to do this very quickly. So let's get started. Okay, so the most interesting thing about the Dollar Tree hauls are, you know, you're clicking on because someone said they have makeup. So I'm not going to wait till the end to show you the makeup. I'm going to go ahead and show you the beauty related items first. Okay, so we're going to do that. First thing I found was these L'Oreal Paris. Um, it is for light brown to dark blonde hair. And it's a, a superior performance ombre touch. Okay, and it's kind of like, um, it's like a dye, but it's for ombre. Okay, so I got two of them because I definitely want to try this out on my extensions to see how it works. You know, once they get a little bit older. So I got these. I got my old stand by me. This is the Ambro Pro Style Protein Styling Gel. I love this gel because it is black. It is very, very thick. And this is like old school gel. This gel will slick your edges better than any edge control. It just makes it a, a tad bit wet. So if you're looking, you know, you want it to keep it straight, you're going to want to get this gel. Okay, so they have the little one. It's only 4.5 ounces, but it's at the Dollar Tree. I love this. I got a few lippies. Here are the first two are by e.l.f. And it was interesting because these are the extra lip glosses and they are men's names. So this one is Michael. And it's like a nudie pink color. And then this one is Brett. And it's more like a ready, more red. This has more... Drop something this is more here. like a pink brown nude and then this one is more red and do I see shimmer this looks like it has a little bit of shimmer in it so that's Brett and then I got NYC liquid lip shine in nude New York and they had all kind of colors of this but I wanted to try the nude I've dealt with the lip shines and they're really, really, really shiny. You don't need any gloss, so I thought I'd just stick with the nude. So that's how that one looks. I got quite a few eye products. First, I got two of the e.l.f. eyeshadow brushes. These are always good to have, so I doubled up. I already have a few of them in my collection, but I just wanted to have some backup, so I got two more. I saw this L'Oreal Paris Denim Shades Voluminous Million Lashes, no clumps, and it is a blue shade, which is very interesting. So I thought that I would try something different, you know, sometimes, and I got this one in blue. Oh, that was a dollar. And of course, I saw these Milani Shadow Eyes again in two new colors. This is a golden bronze. Got that. And sand dunes, which I love sand dunes because it was a very natural brown. Um, of course, it has like, it looks like it has shimmer in it, but I got two of these because I thought it would make for a great base. I got some more hair elastics. You get 15 in a pack. And I got another boar bristle brush for my edges.
They had some new cell phone cases for my phone. I have a Galaxy S5, so I wanted to try these ones. Some spring designs. So this is the first design. Beautiful, right? This is the second. This is the third. And they never have cases for me, so I was very excited about that. I just picked up these little waste baskets for my dog and this very cute shirt that says been there to that because she chews up everything that she can. I'm always telling her to stop so this is perfect for her. A few household items is are these grip gloves. They have they're very like rubbery on the back but they're soft on the front and I have to do some work under the sink so I thought that these gloves would be appropriate. I got a handy chamois which was 25 cents and I got some PVC electrical tape. This is great because it comes with two rolls of the electrical tape in there and it's very thick. I'm going to be working on a command board, a command center on the side of my refrigerator so I am super duper excited about this. So um, I will make a video about it so if you guys are interested look forward to that. But a few things that I bought for the command center was this which I meant to put back when I found these two baskets. I figured I could put all the pencils, well I'm going to put the um, notepads and things like that in here and clip it to the I refrigerator. I got some push pins for the bulletin board that I purchased. Some poster tack to hook uh, the envelopes on the refrigerator. Here is the bulletin board that I found and it comes with a little bit of push pins These but I got the two bubble mailers that I'm going to use. I'm going, I'm going to have one for mail and one for bills and um, this is going to be on the refrigerator. I found some stationary stickers, some letter stickers. These are so cute for spring colors and you get 121 in there. And these are just all green and that's 370. All and lastly, I got this little file folder. I kind of wanted to something a little bit smaller for my couponing. Um, just so that I have and I want to be a little bit more specific in stores. So I got this. And after I do my under the sink work, I bought two of these big old dish pans so that I could organize all of my overstock that I've purchased through couponing underneath the sink. So finally we come to the last few things which are some food I items. I had some Old Orchard drinks there. I got the Ruby Red Grapefruit and then I got the Tropical Fruit Punch and it's uh, 32 fluid ounces for $1. I got an original coffee made creamer. I just started drinking cappuccino in my Keurig and my daughter simply said, oh, you just need to add some creamer to it. So I'm just going to try the creamer and see how I like it. But I got it in the original flavor. Uh, next thing is I got these Bugles potato chips or corn snacks. I had a coupon for 50 cents off of two. So I got two and it, it met the requirements of the coupon, 3.7 ounces. Um, and so I got these two for $1.50. Um, this is the hot buffalo flavor and then this is the nacho cheese. That looks like everything that I got from the Dollar Tree. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I encourage you to run out to your Dollar Tree. If you saw anything here that you liked, the most of what I was... Um, excited about were these elf lip glosses those were good um you know everything else everything else is normally there i kind of wanted to get some of those spring storage containers for organizing but all were all of them were gone in my area so i'm gonna have to do some more research so but um that was the best thing i think that i saw oh i forgot something I forgot something guys. I forgot this Alme Clear Complexion. I forgot. How did I miss this? I do not know. But here it is. This is the Alme Clear Complexion. And it has a treatment gel on the bottom and then it has a concealer on the top. 
And I got it in medium, which is probably too light for me, but this is the darkest color that they had. And I was not going to leave this in the store. Not Almay product. So I got that and I'm going to try it out and see what it says. Okay, so guys. thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Deuces. Let's go. Feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling my, feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling my, feeling my, feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling my, feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling my.